please subscribe to this channel and also tap the notification bell in order for you not to miss out on any of our videos the surprising and moving gesture of pope francis at the conclusion of the two-day spiritual retreat for peace in south sudan in 2019 which the pope hosted in his own house has an evangelical feel it is a forceful image which cannot be understood except in the climate of reciprocal forgiveness that characterized the two days of retreat. It was not a political or diplomatic summit, but an experience of prayer and common reflection among leaders who, despite having signed a peace agreement, are struggling to ensure that it be respected. Pope Francis knelt down and kissed the feet of South Sudan's rival leaders in 2019 in an unprecedented act of humbleness to encourage them to strengthen the African country's faltering peace process. He appealed to President Salva Kiir, his former deputy turned rebel leader Riek Machar and three other vice presidents to respect an armistice they signed and to commit forming a unity government. Then he got down on his knees and kissed the leader's feet one by one. President Kiir, his main opponent Rek Machar, Rebecca Garang, wife of the former leader Jean Garang, and Tabang Deng Gai, Kiir's first president, looked visibly shocked by the gestures that Pope Francis knelt down to kiss their feet in turns. In his first reaction since the incident, Kiel said it could signal one of two consequences, a blessing or a curse. The Pope usually holds a ritual washing of the feet with prisoners on Holy Thursday, but has never performed such a show of deference to political leaders.